What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are at our Duchess yard. I just grabbed this aluminum trailer. I am running to my brother's house. Tomorrow his driveway is getting paved and the roller is still in his driveway. So I need to get it on this trailer and get it out of there. That way it's not in the blacktop guy's way. But luckily my father had a couple chain binders and some chains here. Otherwise I would have had to run to my house first and grab them off of the freight liner. But I found some up in the garage, so we're good on that end. But there's also a piece of concrete. It seems like it's off his foundation or something that we missed when we were there working somehow. And I need to jackhammer it. So that is why I brought our jackhammer here. I was gonna do it with the sledgehammer and that uh, chisel over there. But luckily I have the jackhammer that should make it much easier. But now that I have the trailer all connected, let's head on over there. We'll get the machine loaded up and see what we have to do with that concrete. All right guys, so I just pulled up here. I have the hood open on the roller here because I thought it was gonna be dead, but it actually started right up. It is pretty warm out today. So that probably has a lot to do with it. When we were trying to start it at my house, it was, pretty cold and you guys might have seen that video it wouldn't start it needed some extra juice but over here we have this little piece that somehow we completely missed i don't know what happened with that but you can see over here we jackhammered the rest all the way across under the door but we got to get this down at least two inches or so that way when they pour the blacktop it will cover this and you won't have blacktop concrete blacktop so I have our jackhammer here. I just put a flat bit on it and I'm about to knock that out and then we will get this thing loaded on the trailer. All right guys, so we got that all jackhammered out of the way. I also did a little piece in this corner here that I just noticed. This electric Hilti jackhammer is a game changer and it's also super light. You can lift it with one hand, so very nice i also ran down here i forgot before i came here that we extended this retaining wall for him so i pulled out all of the forms and backfilled at least the front side the back we need to throw a little bit more dirt and that's why we have the pile there but now we can at least blacktop here with no issues i think he is gonna run a piece of berm up here just to keep all the water coming down the hill here out of the yard and it'll run right across the driveway here but i'm about to load this roller up hopefully it'll start again let me turn this camera on real quick Open this Will she start? Do I turn the power off? Uh -huh. Nice.
All right, guys, we are all loaded up and chained down. But as we were doing this last binder here, the weld on the pocket opened up and that has me concerned. So the back two are in pockets and so is this one. And I don't know if, I don't know if these are much stronger than the pockets. That's just a plate down there. I don't know what holds that in. So I'm a bit worried if I move this to there, or even if I went right down to that pocket, if one of these weld snaps while I'm driving, then we got an even bigger issue on our hand. So my brother just moved his car. I am not towing this out of here today. I'm gonna pull the trailer up on the side yard and leave it there for the night and show this to my father, I guess tomorrow when we're here. If we have to come here with the freight liner, we will. I'm definitely not towing it like that. That has me super concerned. So I think that is pretty much it for this one. We're gonna leave it on the side yard tomorrow. We'll be here. I think the blacktop guys are gonna be here at like 7 a.m. probably, maybe 8 a.m. I know they have about an hour and a half ride up here. So as long as they make it here, we should have this driveway and my driveway paved tomorrow. But that's gonna wrap it up. If you guys have any questions or comments, definitely leave them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys next time. Peace.